These apples were created using the applique tool in the software. By using this tool, I was able to insert different fabrics. For preview, I could change my cover stitching. I could move the offset to accommodate the excess fabric that's left as I cut these objects in place in the hoop. As I cut around that fabric, I'm going to leave a little bit of an edge, and that's going to be covered because I could offset the cover stitch. I've used different stitch types here and overlapped my objects. If I were to stitch these out, I don't want to have the bump left from that heavy satin stitching so that it would be seen in this upper applique. To eliminate that, I can drag a bounding box around all of my objects to select them or come up to the upper menu and drop down to edit and select all. Once all my objects are selected, I open up the edit toolbox and select the option to remove applique overlaps. It's that quick and easy. Once that's done, all of the excess stitching from underneath any of the applique objects has automatically been removed. And this design is now ready for an excellent stitch out.